Wire a 2 station up slash down push button control, also has a capacitor, run capacitor if I am not mistaken. Have some photos of the inside of the existing controller. Basically want to make two stations. Help. Welcome. My name is would be glad to assist. What is needed, is this, one. How many wires connect to the pendant station now? Hard to tell in the manual, four to five? Two. Do you have a continuity tester to check the push button contacts on the pendant station? Three. How do you plan to join the pendant station to a wall station? Or, are you wanting to do away with the pendant and only have two wall stations, one up and one down? 4. Do not remove any wires from the pendant until you lock which terminals they connected to for reference. Thanks. Thanks for the quick response. I will respond to your questions with the same numbers listed in your reply one. The pendant station has four wires green, black, brown, deep red. There is also another bright red wire that jumps from one terminal to another. I will attach photos of this, also a diagram of how it's currently wired. Also two more black wires connected to what I think is a run capacitor too. I do have a Fluke 117 to check continuity. I will try my best to check the continuity for you. 3. Good question. I plan to do away with the pendant. I will have to separate push button stations, one in the attic, another down below. Both will control up and down movement 4. I have photographed them well. I know know where they connect. What I am confused about is the capacitor. Do I have to run a second capacitor to the second push button station? The wiring is what's confusing me. I hope I have provided enough information to you. I have also included a drawing on how it's currently connected. Thanks please let me know if you want to test something else out etc. Sorry for the rough drawing. I inserted the photos here. I don't know if you can see them, but they have much information. Perhaps copy and paste to your computer and you could see them better. The wiring diagram also shows how they are numbered and when I get a reading on my fluke when I push up and down. Let me know if you need the photos in a different format. Also, when I tested the up-down buttons, I tested them with all the wires disconnected. Thanks for all the great pictures and sketch. Give me a little time to look it all over and then we'll post back if additional information is needed. Thanks. Okay, here is the diagram for parallel stations. If there is any chance of someone being at both locations and trying to operate the hoist at the same time, you need to either install relays or a locked station to keep them from using the up at one and down at the other at the same time. Otherwise, you only have to parallel the stations together so they connect to the same points at each one. You will need a rocker switch to match the one you have now. It makes the center terminals in contact at the top or the bottom depending on up or down. Just a DPDT momentary 3 position rocker switch, just be sure the center terminals are the common ones. Look at the diagram and I show the contacts between the terminals. Only one capacitor is needed, mounted at the hoist and run wires from each station back to the hoist controller and capacitor, so you keep all the connections and common tie points at the hoist. You can label each wire so you know where they go or color code wires, either way. Let me know any questions. I actually went out and bought a couple of uptown switches. I started tinkering with some test leads and I got the same as what you diagrammed. I will test it out tonight. Thanks. 
Switches look right, just verify the center tabs make with the top two in one position and then with the bottom two in the other position. Be sure of the amperage rating on those switches also, you need at least a 10 amp rating on the switch. The hoist runs at 4.1 and when it starts it pulls much more than that for a brief moment. So, to avoid any burnouts, a 10 amp minimum should work fine. Works great. Thanks. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.